Hey everyone, Tom Hartman from Traders Post here with another addition to our library. This one is called Simple Trend Lines. Now the goal of this indicator is to help you with technical analysis and with surfing some different types of strategies that you might be in the mood for. And so, um, so Simple Trend Lines, as the name indicates, adds trend lines to your charts. Now we know there are all kinds of different trend lines that are available to you on TradingView, uh, but there are as many trend lines as there are people. And so we pre present this as a way that you can go about it. Uh, two special key points about this indicator. Uh, one, it does have sources, data sources available within it so that you'll be able to track new pivots, new trends, and trend breaks that happen on the chart. So if you go down to the bottom of the settings for this script, you can click on, let's say, show trend breaks, and it'll mark when different trends were, were broken, um, either high or low trends. And this is not just visual on the chart, but you have different alerts available for it. As well as if you're using our confluence of alerts indicator, you'll be able to access this within the dropdown. This is something that not a lot of scripts uh, that are doing trend lines have. Also, if you're interested in coding at all, uh, we did a video walkthrough of how we actually wrote this. Um, so it's a, it's a great advanced sort of look at PineScript. Um, but what's great about it is that if you take a look at the code, the entire code is documented as best as we can so that you can go ahead and see step-by-step step why everything was created and how you can go about thinking. Some additional are there for you include things like being able to change the source for the pivots. Um, you can change um, how many pivots in, in back in time you want to track. Uh, you got to be careful with this. If you put this number too high, it'll uh, the system will, will break um, because it might be just too much data for it to crunch. Um, you can decide to show past trends on a chart. So if you want to see past trends that had a certain level of conviction to it, um, which is say number of times that the, the price crossed that you can. So for example, over here, as I'm activating it, you're, you're seeing here that the price passed through these areas multiple times and wherever the price passes through, you have a, um, uh, a little label, a little marker that, sh that shows it on the chart. Really great if you're trying to discover new patterns that you, that you didn't see before. Um, I find it very useful for when you are wondering, hey, why did the price respond to this area here? I'm not seeing anything in particular that, uh, that it would be responding to. Sometimes it could be a trend line or even a convergence of trend lines at that location. Um, you can also uh, run us on the, on the log scale. So right now, the, 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 if we're looking at Bitcoin, we're looking at Bitcoin on a regular chart. But if we, create, if we set it up to a logarithmic chart, um, we can then set the script to log scale in order to make sure that the, the levels pass through where they need to uh, pass through. And we can extend um, confirmed trends amongst other things. So um, this is not the be all and end all of scripts. Uh, it is really there to help you again with your trading strategy and maybe to help people inspire them to create their own. Um, but as always, if there's any new features you're interested in, you find this to be particularly useful, let us know inside of our Discord or you can go to um, uh, send us a message through our email and we'll be happy to follow up with that. Uh, we really want to be the best automated trading platform for you. And this is just one of the ways we're going to do it by creating tools that can help make you more profitable potentially and inspire you to bigger and greater strategies. See you next time.